Our mobile devices are more similar to computers than they are phones, but why is it we don't protect them the same way? Recent studies have shown that more than half of all PCs are protected with an antivirus program, compared to only just 5% of smartphones and tablets. Android is the most used mobile operating system, which is the reason why it's targeted by cybercriminals more than any other mobile platform. I'm Dan Graziano, and I'm going to share with you some of the easiest methods for keeping your Android device malware-free. When downloading apps, stick to a legitimate app store such as Google Play, Amazon's App Store, Samsung Apps, or one of the marketplaces from your carrier. Even when you're on these stores, you have to be on the lookout for suspicious apps with odd permissions and bad reviews. Many times, malicious apps can look similar to legitimate ones. This was the case with a fake BBM app that surfaced a few months ago. Then there's the issue with sideloading apps. Case in point, you're opening up your device to more malware if you install apps outside these major stores. If you must do it, make sure you get the app from a trusted developer's website. Most pirated or cracked apps tend to be infused with malware, and let's face it, in the long run, you'll be kicking yourself you didn't buy the real version. Devices running Android 4.2 or higher also have access to a built-in malware scanner for sideload apps. This can be enabled by going to Settings, clicking on Security, and enabling the Verify Apps option. While you're in Settings, scroll down to About Phone and check to see if there's any software updates available. Manufacturers, carriers, and Google are constantly pushing out updates with bug fixes, enhancements, and new features that can make your device more secure. The last and most obvious way to protect yourself from mobile malware is to install one of the many antivirus apps from the Google Play Store. For more information about protecting your device, including a list of some of the best antivirus apps, check out my article on howto.cnet.com. You can also reach out to me on Twitter with any questions, and feel free to share with me some of the tips you use for keeping safe. I'm Dan Graziano for CNET. Thanks for watching.